guys welcome back to another tournament video on pinball effects today let's look at this week's tournament we had on the jurassic park pinball table from universal pinball um this is actually my favorite table out of the three that were released on fx3 and pinball effects it's very atmospheric it's got great sound effects um and some of the modes are pretty cool i like the skill shot uh, the skill shot is kind of tough but uh, you try to land the pinball in the nest and that can be pretty tricky to do. It's all about timing and you know how hard you plunge, I think. And another thing that I noticed, there was a secret skill shot where I think after the plunger, if you hit the scoop in the, in the middle, um, you would get a random word. And I think it was only lit for a while. So that was something that I found pretty cool. Kind of like a hidden skill shot that I never knew about. Um, or I forgot about. Uh, another thing that this table seemed to be very heavy on was orbit shots. So hitting the stampede uh, right orbit was like really crucial. And as well as getting combos. This table was... Uh, you, you were awarded for do, hitting combo shots, right? And so combo shots are basically, you know, hitting multiple loops or ramps in a, sh a short period of time. Um, and some of the modes I liked as well. Uh, I like the kitchen mode where the utensils, you have to hit the utensils. I find that's pretty, like, one of the easiest modes. Um to do where I get a lot of my points from uh, also there's like a raptor mode where you just have to shoot you know lit lanes and keep the ball away from the raptors that one's pretty easy the modes where you the chasing modes I do not like those modes because it's like you're timed and you have to hit the right orbit like I think a couple times and I just don't like that mode um, Another thing that I like about this table, and I think is a crucial thing, is the Magna Save. There is a Magna Save on both sides of the outlanes, and the Magna Saves can actually stack. And there was a couple times where I got Magna Saves and I just didn't do it right. But I actually I figured it out on my controller, um, and the thing with Magna Save is you want to just make sure you press the button just before it drains and the ball will like you can see the ball like coming back up and it's just awesome so something to get used to um, when you play this table I'm trying to think about other things that I want to mention here oh yeah another thing that was cool about this table is when you when you shoot the ball from the plunger or no when you hit the stampede right orbit after you hit that um, you're gonna the ball lock will open up for like five seconds and if you can master getting you know the ball lock in um from the stampede orbit shot you do get like a couple million points that way um so yeah very interesting too and also you have this this uh, award uh mystery awards random awards in the center with this secondary flipper that with good timing um you can get some pretty neat awards Video modes are pretty interesting. I only got to one, I think, where the, the, I forgot the dinosaur, but the um, Triceratops, I think, is eating leaves, and you gotta not eat the poisonous ones. <laughs> um, but yeah, I enjoyed my time with it. A lot better than the Star Wars Darth Vader one, that's for sure. Uh, so now, let's go over the leaderboard here. In the first place, we have Rich C111 with five billion points wow 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 five billion I had a hard time getting past whatever I got I had a hard time getting past or even to 79 million <laughs> but congratulations to you rich c111 um, he always gives great tips in the comments so be sure to uh, look for those if you can find them and uh, he's just a really good pinball player he knows what he's doing and He's not like me. Uh, I really don't like to read the the guide, even though it's there. I'm kind of lazy in that way. But also, 
it's kind of like I, I like kind of exploring um, and kind of learning as I do. But you know, sometimes I will read the guide, and I think it's beneficial, honestly, to read it. So don't be like me, is what I'm saying. <laughs> um, but thank you, Rich C111, for your tips on all the tables that we've been playing so far, and thank you for participating. That is a incredible score, five billion. Um, is that do you usually get a lot of points? Is it the wizard mode or what? What kind of? Let me know in the comments what um, you know. What your tip is? I know that you gave some for this table that I remember, especially the stampede. But uh, let's go to the second place here with Mikhail Thin with 186 million. Another great score here. And in third place we have Urko 1945 with 143 million. This is um, this is pretty cool because Urko, you know, he usually plays EMs. Um, his uh, forte is like older electronic, electronic, electromechanical tables. So it's nice to see him score really high on this uh, original Jurassic table. So congratulations, Urko. I know he had a great time. He, he made the comment, he was kind of saying in the comments that he's he doesn't want to spend time trying to beat Rich C. You know, I, I chuckled at that. Okay, and fourth, we have my arch nemesis, Balchi99, with 139 million. Another great score. Um, I always try to beat Balchi. I, I tried this time, but I couldn't come close. Because in fifth place we had Bad Jack Daniels, who I actually got ahead of for a little while, and then I checked I think yesterday and he surpassed me. So he got me there. I thought I was safe, but I didn't pad my score enough. So congratulations to Bad Bad Jack Daniels with that impressive score of 89 mil million. <clears throat> and in sixth place we have Dracky Barks with 82 million. Uh, thank you to Dracky Barks. He was really the one that kind of gave me the inspiration to do these daily, these weekly tournaments. So I owe it all to him. Um, I was doing tournaments before, but you know, I kind of wasn't consistent. So now I'm trying to be as consistent as possible because I enjoy them, um, and I also enjoy joining y'all's tournaments. Uh, I came in seventh with 79, 79 million points. Took me a lot of tries to get there, but um, I think I got I, I think I got one extra ball at one point, and um, it was just one of those games I had where I had a really good ball one, like a phenomenal ball one, and then the second ball was like lasted five seconds, you know. But. Uh, so we have an 8th place brew underscore dude with 38 million points. And in ninth place we have PFX fan with 30 million points. And just underneath him in 10th place we have Leon 102 with 25 million points. So thank you once again everyone for participating in this weekly tournament. Um, as you guys know I haven't been making pinball M tournaments just because I kind of want to wait until we have more tables. Um, and uh, doing tournaments, uh, I, I, I found out that doing two was kind of a lot for me, so I'm just sticking to one for now. And for this week, um, I'm creating a tournament on a table that I think everyone knows. But that is because VPW came out with a very nice version of um where is it here where is that fishtails right so fishtails vpw came out with a version today uh, that you can download on vpx um i'm gonna upload a video later on for it but i figured in celebration of their release of fishtails why not the best tournament table one of the funnest tables from williams so let's go here Gotta keep it classic. Uh, unlimited. We'll do six. We do six days, right? Six days. Unlimited attempts. Gameplay. What is this? Oh, normal. I think wasn't classic. I wonder what the difference is. Let's keep it normal. 
because I thought that was with classic, right? Classic, right? Classic. I like classic, so I thought. Challenging. Should we do challenging? <laughs> like, is that the thing? Nah, let's do normal. Okay, we'll do it closed. Password for this week's tournament will be 5566. Wait, where is it? Here it is. 5566. <laughs> and here is the tournament code. It's it's HC3X. Put it right here. And let's go. So password is 5566. And I really am excited to see your guys' scores, especially Rich C's. <laughs> because this table, oh my gosh. I, I've seen people score crazy amounts. But yeah, this is in celebration of VPW's version. So let's go on fishing. And honestly, no matter, no matter how many times I play this table, I, I always have fun playing it. It's just a feel-good table. Come on. Oh no. I just want to beat Balchi though, that's all. <laughs> I need Balchi to be chasing my score and not me chasing Balchi's. I love hitting that captive ball in the middle. There's, wait, there is a kickback, isn't there, on the left? Am I... I think there is, or am I... I played this table a lot, and I don't even remember if there's a kickback. I wonder how come I'm not getting that random like award thing see it's popping it out maybe I have to like activate it Ooh. Oh yeah, this is one of the coolest things. Oh no. There we go, ball unlocked. Ball two locked. Pinball. I just love pinball guys and I know you think the same. I know you guys love pinball too. It's just so relaxing. It's so zen. You know, it's like... I said this a lot. I say it a lot, but... It's, it's, nice. it's a comforting kind of nostalgia. Pinball is. Come on, ball save. Thank you. It's, um, pinball is one of those things that, a hobby that, what, 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 did you see that? Like, where did the ball go? Like, oh my gosh. 
Well, what I was saying was pinball is basically like one of those hobbies that it's classic. It remains the same. The core foundation of pinball is pretty much the same, but it's always like coming back to it. I gotta go one more time, guys. I just love this table. I'm also not happy with that score. <laughs> Oh no, come on! Thank you. I know you guys are gonna have pretty crazy scores. <laughs> so, I can't settle for 30. Oh no! Oh, come on, man. Thank you. Oh, I love this. Good thing I didn't do challenging. <laughs> oh, come on. I don't think I'm beating my previous now. <laughs> Extra ball, 100 million. Let's go. Plus, this table's awesome because it's like, oh, come on, man. Are you serious? Oh my gosh. Right when I was talking about how awesome this table was. But, ooh, I got the match at least. Well, guys, thank you for watching me play this week's tournament on Fishtails. Uh, be sure to download the VPW version as well for Visual Pinball. And thank you again to everyone who played in Jurassic Park. I appreciate it. Till next time.